No. F okay. I'm. I'm thinking we do Chester, Drudwin, and Dania for this one. The oh, do we even take Drudwin? You know what? I'm not even gonna take Drudwin. I think these two have got it. I'm gonna bet my bottom dollar that these guys have got it. All right, and to further exemplify that, I'm just gonna not do anything. Hey, thank you, Silent Warlock Cosplay, for the hundred bits. Got this game when I saw you and Rito play it. And I do like this game. Many strats you can employ, and it's fun to experiment. Good luck on your run. Yeah. I think I got this. We'll see how this goes. Aren't those archers? Nope. Also, at least I don't think there are. Uh, also, thank you, Grim Mooser, for the 24 month resub. Hello. How are you doing this fine and lovely evening? I hope this works as well as I think it's going to work, because I'm going to be a very happy camper if it does. This is like the best map layout for this exact team comp. Hello! Do you enjoy spears from on high? <laughs> the big men are a little spooky, but we'll see how it goes. I mean, hopefully the knockback will... Wait. Does Dania... Oh, shoot. No, no, it was my archers that had the boosted knockback. That's unfortunate. What if archers come? I don't think they're coming on this map. <laughs> Alright, I think we're good. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. <laughs> oh, this is good stuff. Final wave incoming. Oh no, what will I do? Okay, that got a little spooky for a second there. I think we're still fine. It was, a little, it was a little worrying, all the same. Oh, question. Ah, uh, I can't do a downhill charge. <laughs> they even paused for a second. Uh, is this worth it? No. Wow, all of that for three Peasley coins. I'm frankly a little offended on behalf of my own men. So here's the immediate problem. We actually have too many people. Now, I could skip Harsh Rock. It's... Oh, but they're huge. I don't know. Okay. So who can we upgrade? I haven't upgraded my archers yet. So it wouldn't be a bad idea to get them up, like Hanuk, up to the next level. Because they also have the increased knockback and stun. Otherwise, we make Dania big strong. I... I gotta. Okay. Because here's the thing. We've still got... One, two, three days? Three days before we need to take Dania anywhere. I think we're going to go Ragged Rock. We either do Ragged Rock or we do Rissé. Because Rissé gets me another character. Uh, head for Rissé gets me another character. Or we do Ragged Rock for an item. Um, there's also just Alro. Harsh Rock, you can do it. Well, I don't want to. I was just thinking, um, the reason why I wanted to put off Harsh Rock for a little bit is this gets me an item. Yeah, let's go Ragged Rock first, because Harsh Rock is just going to give me money. 
Ragged Rock is going to give me some stuff. This is probably fine. We'll live without an archer. It's not like they gain EXP here anyway. Okay. Get you up. Get you over. I don't even know which direction they're coming from, which I guess is a bit of a downer. Okay. Let's just probably do two men pincer tactics. No, they're going for this one. Oh, this shit again. Oh, 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 okay. That's where this goes. It goes up here. Yeah, I should have predicted that. All right, let's do that again. Uh, you guys go up here. There we go. Because these guys are not going to hit the spearmen. And spearmen can handle the secret tunnel. That secret tunnel sucks. I am decidedly peeved. Okay, there we go. Wow. Okay, see a couple more. This one sucks. Oh. This one's gonna suck. Oh my god, the big guys just eat your dudes into the ocean. Okay. Y'all need to freaking bail. Uh, okay, he dead. Shit. We need more pikemen. Because, uh, I don't stand a chance without them. Okay. Oops. You go back. At least they heal quick. There we go. Alright. We don't get absolutely bodied here. We're landing on that space. There we go. You guys just go up the hill. Okay, so big guys are spooky as shit. But they eat landmines for breakfast. And by for breakfast, I mean it's probably morning and... I mean, they certainly ate it. Oh, that's some good money. Whew! There we go. Tried to, uh, tried to post the song lyrics for Secret Tunnel and it was deleted. It had too many caps. Made Nightbot spooky. Alright, so we get something. What do we get? Consumable. Use this to bring a fallen commander back to life. Well, that's never gonna happen. Because I'm just gonna restart. Anyway, John Tur, time to fight Calsoid by yourself. <laughs> just absolutely gets clobbered. 
So I think we're going to want to pick up some more, um, some more spearmen. Mainly just because I'm going to have the hardest time potentially taking on every single one of these islands. So in this case, I think I'm going to want to split up Chester and Dania just so we have the chance of getting three islands in one day. Um, now, obviously, I could do Kalsoy and Rasay and Hope, but I think I just want to go for Harsh Rock and just make it work. Yeah, Brutes are tough. But they are. On the plus side, this is actually a pretty defensible setup. As in, they're only going to... I only have to defend this section. Everything else is just kind of whatever. Uh, so we do not want Chester in this. Uh, I'm going to... I'm going to do these three. Now, I could get more archers. There's no way we can do this with just archers and sheep and one spear, though. Do I want to get a second? Actually, it'd be fine. Let's not use Chester. Let's bring Drudwin. We're only going to get two islands done today, but it's fine. Well, here's the thing. Because then for the other maps, I could do Chester and Drudwin and then Dania and Hannock. Which wouldn't be bad unless we get absolutely surrounded. Yeah... I could probably I could probably pull that off. Let's let's see what we're up against first. We don't we do have a shieldman. And we have got a really good spot for my archers. Uh okay, those are a bunch of archers. Come on. I definitely need to upgrade my own archers. They are not good enough. Hello! Okay, and then these guys didn't take a hit. Move these guys over here. extra oomph then that's just a bunch of basic dudes well so far so not bad it's really when the brutes show up that's what I'm trying to that's what I'm trying to kind of counter pick here they might actually only show up on the final wave if that's the case, I can potentially just uh, landmine the hell out of them. Let's bring our guys back a little bit. This is just enough that they'd shove them out of the square, and that's not something we want to deal with. Oh, baby. I love it when they hand, hand me something like this. Assuming this works out, sometimes layouts like this are not actually viable. Pikes seem to be very good. They're very good. Oh, <laughs> oh baby. Oh, boy. Okay.
Okay. That messed the brutes up pretty bad. Got another set, though. I don't think... No. I'm not gonna risk it. Um... Here's the thing. We move here. Oh, he does not have the arrow storm. Okay, that was not the end of it. Oh, no, that was the end of it. Okay. What? Wait, was it because somebody was healing in there we didn't get any money from it? That's tacky. Oh, what am I going to do about it? Okay. So that puts me in a good spot to upgrade Hannock. Because we can't upgrade Chester, Oscar, or Drudwin. So yeah, let's let's get Hannock up. And do we do Kalsoy? Kalsoy. Oh, I got the checkpoint, whatever that is. Got it. Okay, so this is going to be... Probably Dania and Hannock. Because it's just going to be big dudes. This could go badly for me, but I'm going to put my faith in me. Hannock at the Disco. Hannock at the Disco Elysium. That's actually working really well. Jesus, though. This looks like it's going to get a little stinky real fast. Well. Rip me. Move back and just hope this is good enough. Alright, so far so good. As long as they come at me like this, if I have to split my party to deal with these guys, then I'm in trouble. Okay. We do have some dirty, stinking tunnels that I'm going to have to be a little wary of. That's a lot of dudes. Shit. Anything else? Nope. Next time I do this, though, I'm absolutely giving the knockback to my Spearman for extra goofs. Wow. It is just an endless deluge of, of men. Well, we have two easy solutions to large quantities of men. Namely, drop a shit ton of arrows on them and drop a shit ton of arrows on them. Let's wait until they get a little closer. Bye! <laughs> oh, one lived. Got him. Perfect. Good money. We killed a lot of boys there. Alright, how much do I have? Twelve. No, eight. I was off. Well, oh, if I do Rase, we get another person. It's not going to be the greatest, but yeah, sure, let's do it. Because yeah, this gets me Godrin, which, oh, is actually just a shield dude from the start, looks like. Oh, dang. Alright, well, on the plus side, they're only attacking from, like, here. So now it's just a matter of figuring out how to best screw them over. Oh, nope. Here. Here's the plan. Welcoming party.
Does this game cost any money? Yeah, I think it's like 10 bucks. It's worth it though. Okay, so the big dudes are way less of a pushover than I thought they would be. Shit. This is officially problems. How are you guys doing? I will wait, but that's bad. Yeah, Chester is no Dania. Okay. Did you guys lose? Not too many. At the same time. Probably good enough for that. Uh, let's see. Yeah, they're good enough for this. Final wave incoming. Okay, so here's the problem. I'm pretty much just gonna have to chuck my dudes out and hope for the best. As I have no landmines or anything. Absolute fight party, we got it. There we go. A little dicey. Iron skin. Big dude just smacked another guy into the sea. Yup, it's a, a worry. Bumble Island. Oh boy. Oh, we got a lot of brutes to deal with. I don't know if I'm going to be able to beat this tonight. This keeps getting uh, punchier. Oh, next turn. At least we've got like multiple days ahead of the uh the wave of darkness um let's go to Alro what are we what are we dealing with with Alro <gasps> I thought this was going to be a fun island it it does not look as fun as I was thinking it would be Bumble Island makes me chuckle. And then there's Herringoland, which is actually not so bad. I think we'll I think we're gonna go back down to maybe two islands. Cause if we do two islands, then we can always take Dania in. At least until Chester gets better. Um better at fighting. Cause I think if we can get uh I think if we can get Chester up to Dania levels, then maybe we can take three islands at a time. I feel like Bumble Island's gonna be a slaughter. It's gonna be interesting. I'll I'll give it that. But I'm so I'm so far ahead that we could probably do Herringaland, which also gets me an item. Dania being able to go twice a day is a great thing. Yup, it's one of my favorites. Uh, swap Oscar. Out. Ooh, yeah, yeah. Let's probably throw on Godrin, just because Godrin is kind of eh. Actually, no, this is probably going to be the harder one. So do I want to do... Oh, here we go. That's probably a good balance, because next round we'll be able to do the better archer, the worse tank... Both of my spearmen. 
I think that should be good. Let's see what this mystery third party is. Because that's going to change a lot. Let's move him up. We're not going to be using him for anything. Okay. Use the choke point, they say. All right, I say. Now, do I... Are there only three unit types for me? <laughs> they literally just threw themselves at my spears. Because I, I, I would absolutely... I, I wish I had... Um... Brutes of my own, because I think that would be really fun. I get why I don't. This is just... <laughs> Poor these guys. I would love to see a version of this that was actually deeper, or like, Advance Wars. Oh man! Can you imagine this, but like... With advanced, advanced wars or like tiny metal levels of like unit variety. God, that would be amazing. What a choke point this is. Because then we're going to have these guys just... This area is going to be piled high with bodies. Let's see if we've seen our new unit types. Okay. Do that. Get scuffed. Okay. Um... These guys are going to have to go here. Oh, there's the new unit type. It's a higher, t higher tier shield man. Okay. Actually, swap these. Okay. And this guy's locked in. Please stop burning that house. There we go. Okay, so it's a higher tier shield man, and that's about it. Not bad. And there's a shit ton of money. So that should make Chester into a beast. Warhammer. Oh. Oh. Okay. Now, we have a couple of options with that. What does the Warhammer do? A heavy Warhammer used for clearing large groups of foes. Oh. What does that do? Like, does it give one of my dudes a Warhammer? I guess we'll find out. Yeah, it's probably like a commander weapon, if anything. I... Huh. Because in that case, I think we might want to give it to Godrun. Who takes reduced damage anyway. That said... I think I'm gonna make, uh... I'm gonna make Chester peak first. And then, yeah, we'll give... We'll give Godrun the Warhammer, which looks like we can upgrade it a couple of times. Cool. Because, yeah, Dreadwind's got the money. Dania's got multiple uses. Hennick and Jontor are never going to be in melee. Oscar's got the mines. Yeah, that should work. Okay, so where are we going? I'm going to have... Oh. I'm going to have an archer. I'm going to have two, two high-tier spearmen. What's the cup do again? Revives a dead leader.
do I want to just do Alro or do I want to hit Long Longe while we're here? Because I feel like Longe would be a real easy one to tackle with this group. Alro sounds like a good map to bring in your A-team. Oh, wait, no, no, no. We want to do Alro for this one now. I'm thinking about it. Also, thank you, Rip1311, for the Prime sub. Thanks so much. Yeah, this one's got the good, uh... The good choke points. I don't see the Warhammer on him. Oh, Ground Pound is a use item. Got it. So it, it is like the land, uh, the landmine. Okay. Just in case. And if he decides to go around, well, then we're in trouble. I don't think he's going to, though. Come for me. And then you will see a world of devastation. There we go. I think we've got this. This might honestly be overkill, all things considered. But I'm so far ahead at this point that I can feasibly do overkill. Get Rex. Oh boy. Uh, I think I'm fine. But the big guys have certainly put the, uh, the fear of Gord in me. This is it? Holy shit, this was trivial. Put them there as a stopgap, just in, in case they decide to take a weird path. Uh-oh. I did say just in case they decide to take a weird path. All right. So far, so good. Ah, mango iced tea. Freaking delicious. I probably could have done that with just, like, maybe one. But, you know what? I mean, look at this. What is it on? It's on day 14. I'm on like day 22. That puts me in a good spot. So how do we want to do this one? Because Bumble Island could either be hilariously easy or absolutely miserable. And I have no idea how many enemies we're dealing with. Because what I'm thinking is, what if I just took Dania in? Like just by herself, could she take Bumble Island and defend it? Because as far as Longay goes, <sighs> as far as that goes, actually, what if it was Dania and maybe just Oscar? Because I could do Dania and Oscar, then two. Does Pike Charge work on Brutes? As far as I know, yes. Uh, let's see. We want to save up for probably upgrading him. Yeah, let's give this a shot. Let's see how many dudes show up. If it becomes problematic, then we just bail. Let's see if we get really lucky with this setup.
I think we might be fine. Okay, that one guy got a little close for me. I think we're good. Yep, there they go. I thought this was going to be scuffed, but it looks like this is actually kind of Cake Town. Welcome to Cake Town. Boy, you better bet this island floods, not infrequently. And it probably sucks. I'm not even sure why they'd be invading this. What are you going to get out of it? Water? Okay, there's three of them now. Nope, still fine. Why would anyone want to live there? Uh oh. Okay, yeah, this is what I was afraid of, and this is why I figured bringing a second second set of dudes would be the smart move. Okay, mess them up. Oh, kill him? Okay. This is problematic. Oh, well, that was awkward. They just kind of didn't feel like fighting him for some reason. Uh. Yeah, I should have put more landmines down. I just wasn't sure if how many more I'd have to deal with. Okay, and there's another new group. Yay. On the plus side, it looks like Bresse is going to be pretty easy to go. Like go through. So, if... I gotta think on that one. Bresse might be a good spot for me to bring ha Hannick and John tour. Dania, Hannick, and John tour? And then that leaves us with Godrin, Chester, and Drudwin for Longe. Or Isle of Hand. Isle of Hand wouldn't be bad. Longe seems weird. Now let's let's give this one. Okay. Yeah, this is this is the archer map. All right, deploy. To some degree, if this map seems like it's gonna actually cause problems, I just abandon this house. We lose like one money. And then beyond that, just win. Okay, so this looks to be the upgraded version of the basic unit. Probably more durability, no shield, maybe more damage. I get how that boat is empty on arrival. Hello, you've arrived. Whoops. Yeah, if I absolutely have to, I abandon this and park her like right here and just, oh. That's a new problem. Okay, so those guys jump. That's an that's an issue.
Oh, but if the final wave is just gonna be these guys, then I think we're fine. Let's just put our dudes up the hill. I don't even think, think they're gonna make it. Okay. There we go. Yeah, they can't jump up hills. And we didn't have to sacrifice the gold down there. We only lost three people. Not so bad. Suddenly the idea of sending characters into houses to get reinforcements has gotten a little weird. Now that I'm thinking about it. Alright. Uh, well, what do we got? Longe, Isle of Hand, or... Any of these other ones. Uh, oh, hey. Actually, option. Now, option A. We've already upgraded Chester. We could upgrade Godrin, so Godrin is tougher. Or, we make Drudwin tankier. For this, make him tankier. And let's do Isle of Hand. Because as long as they're not hitting this house, then that gives me some really good choke points that I can just rely on Chester for. Godrin is not ready yet. It's fine. Okay, let's see how this goes. So if they decide to go, whoop, then I head them off of the pass. Oh, wow. <laughs> they're just like, oh, they're coming up the hill, aren't they? All right, spears down, boys. Come at me. I hope you enjoy poking. Okay. You gotta get over here. You guys get gotta be ready to take these guys out. Oh right, and the brutes don't care about vandalism, do they? Brutes are purely here for smackins. Oh okay. Here's the thing. I gotta try the Warhammer. <laughs> ah! Oh, shit! They just totally skipped my dudes. Well, that sucked. On the plus side, it's raining. I don't know if that gives me a tactical advantage, but still. Ground pound, eh? Yep, looks like it. Pretty solid one at that. Let's just do that. Shield wall. Oh, they have throwing axes. Okay, final wave incoming. Let's do something like that. Bring these guys back a bit. There we go. Because, yeah, these guys were going to get impacted in some way. And they're just dead. <laughs> Those axe shield dudes are not nice to spearmen. Yeah! I mean, I feel like it's kind of vengeance for how not nice my spearmen have been th through this entire playthrough. Like, I have been. Demonstrably unkind to my foes. Okay. Island. Oh, gosh. <laughs> that looks questionable. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. How do we want to do this one? So we could do Volan or Longe. And try and do Dania and Oscar again. 
island is spooky. And actually, Samson is going to be brutal. Because the uh, Samson and Island are going to be brutal because we have Berserkers and no height advantage. Ooh. So Long Longgate should be pretty easy to just throw Denia and Oscar at again, maybe. 